the journey home relieved Australians on the first repatriation flight from India in weeks touched down in Darwin. But what's next for the thousands still stranded in the COVID-ravaged country? It's about 400 inquiries we are getting to send oxygen concentrated to India. Good evening. Dozens of Australians who were repatriated from India are preparing for their first night in the Northern Territory's Howard Springs quarantine facility. Their arrival coincided with the end of the Morrison government's temporary travel suspension. 150 passengers were supposed to return, but 70 tested positive or were deemed a close contact of a positive case and were not permitted to fly. Some on board have told SBS that they're thankful to escape the COVID hotspot. But worries remain for the thousands still in India. The community mobilising resources. Panaki Chatterjee runs the Australian branch of an Indian delivery company. He says he's been inundated with requests to send oxygen to India. It's about 400 inquiries we are getting to send oxygen concentrated to India. And with patient numbers overwhelming hospitals in India, health workers here have held a vigil in Melbourne in support of their counterparts. Reporter Gareth Borum was at the event. Medicos have gathered in solidarity with their colleagues in India as they battle to treat the thousands and thousands of critical COVID-19 cases that are flooding an overstretched hospital system. They say such is the dire situation and shortage of critical medical supplies in India. Health workers there are being forced to make moral life and death decisions that could never have been previously contemplated. 